Hey, it's Jonathan. Thanks for joining me today. I hope this video will find you in good fortune. Today I want to cover a, another Catalyst 9, Fund 9 proposal. Um, this one is a proposal by the team that created Drip Drops, um, the dripping platform. If you're not using Drip Drops, I encourage you to find out about it. I have I've made other videos covering the Drip Drops uh, platform and uh, it's a I think it's a really nice platform. I think there's a lot that can be expanded, and this is just a a look into how they might expand it and build off of what they've already created. Uh, look, make sure you check out our blockchain friends. We've got that NFT that's very coming up very soon. We're going to release, um, do that NFT giveaway on Twitter. Keep your eye out for that. Uh, Magic Square NFT. They're actually the ones that create the NFT. It's a <laughs> Ooh, excuse me, it's a Carta Station compatible asset, so you'll be able to drop it right in Carta Station Metaverse and play on it if you want to. Art by Nora, she has an NFT sale coming up. There's your Carta Station revenue minting, revenue uh, property producing property. That NFT is right there. They have a car game, new car game, excellent. World of Cardano, UE5, Metaverse, Dungeons and Dragons type deal. Um, lots of good stuff, lots of fun stuff going on with that project. And that's one to keep up to date with as well. Okay, so we got Drip Drops here. Drip Drops is, um, is basically... Well, here, we'll just, let's go over to their website. Drip Shops is basically, uh, it's the Drip Shops, uh, .io. And if for everybody that's staking uh, Cardano on the Cardano blockchain, uh, then you can come on here and drip tokens every, uh, every epoch, right? Which is every five days. Every epic epoch, okay? Every um, epic. So you can drip some tokens. This is their governance token. And um, I'm mainly, when I mainly started dripping, I mainly want to get on here and grab their governance token. So that's what I made, my main interest was. And I weighed out the cost. Now, I haven't checked it for a while, but I weighed out the cost. The cost of actually dripping these tokens, coming on and claiming these tokens that you pay in gas fee, would be about the same amount that you'd pay to just simply buy some drip tokens. Now, it may have changed. This was a while ago. But uh, a while back, that's what it was you know you have to pay the gas fee so you what you do is you send five ADA and then they'll send you like 4.8 or 4.6 ADA back is what happens so um, and you can choose up to 10 this is their platform you just you know you just select the token it gives you a little check mark and you can just scroll down look you got some cornucopius token here um, you got some stripper token, you got to get your stripper token, you even have some mystery tokens. A lot of these projects, it's going to be like meme projects and things like that. Who knows what these are going to turn into. Some of them might turn into something good. Uh, some of them might turn into, uh, you know, might never be anything except trash in your wallet. But my personal opinion is that it's worth come hopping on here and just uh, dripping um, the drip token and they have a returning uh, if you come back every week then they start giving you multipliers and you have, you have a bonus so they're doing things like that if you drip every week anyway so they've written up this catalyst 9 proposal um, and I think it's really important you know uh, okay I'm from the US and in the early uh, stages of our country there was it was no Federal Reserve or anything like that a lot of the states issued their own currency and you know once you've been in the blockchain for a while it's like oh we have a thousand currencies I, I, I usually hear people say talk about this like it's a like it's a bad thing um, you know and it can be bad because you end up with some scams and some rug pulls and all that stuff but when everybody has the power to issue their own currency it really makes um, it makes it it decentralizes the wealth and it makes people with innovation and ideas uh, it makes them wealthy right as a as opposed to creating a system, making a system wealthy, it can make the individual wealthy. And I tell you the truth, I mean, you know, you can you can go back and forth whether it's a good system or not. Like we had early in this country where the states were issuing their own currency. 
and then we became federalized. Um, it, you know, I, c cryptocurrency is kind of along that lines. Like I see how you know our country started. It was a decentralized power. And then slowly over time, we got re-centralized, re and we've done the same thing with the currencies. Going on with the world, you know, the market's crashing, all that kind of stuff. When you see the market uh, crashing like it is here recently, uh, you know, and I, even I, I've been watching it for a while, but even I realize even more now how uh, the, Fed the U.S. Federal Reserve really controls has a lot of sway I uh, know you know we've always had the reserve currency the petrodollar and this and that but our Federal Reserve holds an incredible sway over the economic system of the world it really does when it wants to uh, um, sh show its strength then it then it can do that and it seems to be able to do that very easily which we've seen here recently um, so a plethora of, of currencies, in my estimation, is not a bad thing. It's not necessarily a bad thing. You sh if you're a content creator, if you're a musician, you should be able to, you're a musician, you should be able to issue, in my estimation, you should be able to issue your own token, and then people invest in that token like they're investing in a stock in a company, um, or you know, they're investing in you, and then they will receive benefits by doing that. Uh, I, I don't see any any problem with this this type of uh, of system, and I would like to see this. Anyway, that's my take on their proposal about kind of what they're trying to do. They want to create Drip Drops wants to create a platform where um, you can pay a multiple uh, array of different cur currencies. And if I'm a vendor, like say I, I'm selling a product. Um, it's going to be a multi-chain platform, and not only a multi-chain. Uh, let's see. Well, their thing is uh, they're going to create a multi-chain payment rail system that enables merchants and consumers to diversify their existing payment options and reach untapped global markets and purchasing power. So, basically, what they're doing is they're uh, drip drops. They're planning on setting up this and this is what their proposal is for their catalyst 9 proposal is to set up a payment system where I can accept um, I can accept you know this person's token or I can accept that person's token as payment for service like almost like a bartering system and I, I think this is a great thing I really think this is a great thing um, and, you know and I like to see it to uh, come to fruition but um, so this is their proposal. This is something that you might want to look at voting on when you do your voting in um, in Fund Nine. And uh, if you're not check, if you're not already on their drip uh, drip drop site, you know, hop on their drip drop site and um, and check it out. I think that's a that's a great. It's you know it's a place where I can go. I have I've staked my ADA and I can go there and I can drip all different kinds of tokens. Some trash, some not maybe. You know, uh, only time will tell, and it's all in the eye of the beholder in the end, really. But um, I'll be able to accept, maybe I can accept Drip Drops token as payment. I have uh, some NFTs I want to sell. Okay, well, I'll accept payment in Drip Drops tokens, or I'll accept payment in one of the other tokens. You know, so this is what it looks like they're going to set up. This is what they're trying to set up. I just think it's a great idea. And, um, and I'll, you know, I'll let you, I'll let you read some of this stuff. Um, I'll, in fact, I'll link their proposal in the description of this video, and you can always go on their, um, their drip drop site and check them out. Uh, you know, follow them on Twitter and things of that nature as well. Okay, you, the best way to support this channel, if you like content like this, uh, the best way to support this channel is to support our blockchain friends. Make sure you like, subscribe, share the video comment on the video if you comment and like then it helps it um, get spread around and if you share it then you're automatically spreading it around and I really do appreciate that um, you know and again check our blockchain friends give them some love um, so I guess that's about it look oh if you want to be on the blockchain friends list 
Uh, if you want information on that, shoot me a DM. I'll send you some information about that. Or if you have a project any size, small, medium, large, any size you want covered or even a catalyst proposal that you like for uh, me to take a look at and uh, we can look at it and, and uh, consider it for a review or for, um, for a video, then just shoot me a DM. I'll be happy to talk to you about that. So look, y'all are beautiful and I'll see you. I'll see you next time.